think he's doing in my life? And I was so inspired by Toby the other day. Um, we were at a uh, kind of a, a dinner and lots of different artists were kind of sharing what God was doing in their life. And he said, you know, I feel like one of the biggest things that, that God is challenging him to do was to remain unjaded. And um, I think on similar lines, I feel like God is just saying, Rebecca, I just want you to be real. I just want you to just admit when you're hurting and admit when life is hard and don't put on the brave face that says everything's okay when, you know, when you're in a vulnerable place. Just just admit it and admit that you're weak sometimes and that's okay and there's like a strength in that and there's a community in that because we all hurt and um, so I think that's yeah what God's teaching me just to kind of come into this place of this is who I am and um, God's you know leading me and um, I'm casting my cares on him but life isn't always a dream you know it's not always perfect but that's okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I would hope that, um, yeah, reading from the Bible from stage helps encourage, you know, young people in my generation to, um, to get into the Bible. And I think the message, it's, you know, it's a paraphrase and it's um, very modern language. And so it helps young people that kind of struggle with some of the older terminology that is in some, um, some versions. It helps it to really sink into their lives. So, um, yeah. I love the message. I, I read it myself still, and um, yeah, I, I want to encourage more people to read it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. one consistent thing throughout 13 years of ministry, that's crazy it's been that long, um, has been that I've really wanted to think out of the box, outside the box, and just kind of, if people would do stuff one way, I want to try it another way, you know, and just, maybe that's the Australian rebel in me, I don't know. <laughs> um, but I think that probably it, it ties into what I shared before, um, what is happening more now in my music is I'm probably writing um, from a place of pain sometimes. And um, there's one song on my most recent album, before this live album that just came out, um, but the one before that was If I Had One Chance to Tell You Something. And there was a song called I Need You, and it says, um, Wide open, my life is now. I hide no more behind the mask. But what you see is what I am. It's reality. Um, and I just, I just think, you know, kind of just being who we are and living that out before God and still seeking to be uncompromising, um, but just admitting that we're all frail. Um, I think people relate deeply to that. And so I want to just be real and live my life freely before God.